Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. Something came to my mind and I, have to, I thought I was done. But I have to share this. When I was talking about the pavers and when I was talking about the woman putting the hot frying pan on the, sto on the countertop, I want to put those both out there so I can let you know what I'm going to deal with. These are analogies. Uh, what dropped in my head was when you are filled with the Holy Spirit, the beating doesn't destroy you. The beating makes you. I have had vans park on my pavers. I have had trucks park on my pavers. During the rain, where we had weeks of rain nonstop, it never caved in under my car. Never. Never a sinkhole. Never a peep hole. Because of the constant pounding of that compactor, that soil had compacted that, had been compacted so tight with the pavers, it made such a solid mass that nothing could penetrate. And it held its own. It was strong. It could carry that load. And that's what the Holy Spirit does in us. It locks us tight into a solid bond of strength. That's why the Bible says, excuse me, in our weakness, God is made strong. God's strength, excuse me, is made perfect in our weakness. That's God's strength working then. Now listen, when the woman put the frying pan on top of the two or three day old uh, epoxy that had cured fully, it didn't leave a scratch, didn't leave a mar, didn't leave a burn, didn't leave a scorch of any kind, no scorch marks. But listen, that's what happens with you. When you are filled with the Holy Ghost, you can take the heat. You can take it, and you will make it all the way through. No matter what comes at you. Whether it rains, or whether you're going through the fire, you will not fold. God bless you.